Hi, my name is Jensen from Cloud9, and these are my top 5 mid laners for solo queue. My number 5 at the moment is Syndra. She's a champion that has a lot of kill potential 1v1, and not only that, she has a lot of um, setup for ganks and stuff, so she's extremely hard to play against. Um, she, ha she has a lot of kill potential and a lot of snowball potential. The only not so good thing about her is that she's single target, so um, she doesn't have that much AoE. But if you use your ultimate and then like E after, you can hit like multiple peel with your stun for example. But yeah, she's a single target um, champ champion for the most part. So she's not like super super good, but the thing the thing about her is that she snowballs so easily and she pressures her, la her lane a lot. So she's like really good during the laning phase and whatnot if you know how to play her properly. And my number four is Lulu. She's arguably a lot higher for some people probably, but honestly, I put it at 4 because she's very easy to play against in lane. Doesn't have that much kill potential, I would say, so she doesn't really snowball that well in solo queue. But for team fighting, she's really good. And if you play with like a good AD carry, for example, you'll win a lot of games with Lulu for sure because um, she can speed up people and the shields and the peeling. Just everything about her makes her a, re a really solid and strong pick. My number 3 is Twisted Fate. He he's a champion that has a lot of map pressure and he's also surprisingly like decent in lane even though a lot of people probably don't think so. Like if you know how to play him properly, you can actually pressure your lane in most situations as well, which makes him an even better pick. He's a champion that's pretty hard to play, requires a lot of games, but he's really good at pressuring the whole map, so it just makes it just makes him an overall really strong pick, and once you get like items, his team fighting is also really good, and yeah, just everything about him makes him a very solid pick. And my number two is LeBlanc. In a way, she reminds a bit about Syndra, but not really. She's a champion that has a really strong laning phase, and a champion that's really easy to gank for and really hard to gank. So it's a champion where you can play really aggressive and she's good at making picks, strong laning phase and just a very snowbally champion. So she's my number two. And my number one is Gangplank. He's the type of champion that takes a lot of games like learn how to get used to him, like learn how to use his barrels and whatnot. But the strong thing about Gangplank is not his laning phase, but the fact that his ultimate does so much damage and is so good at pressuring sight lanes and whatnot. And you just run him with TP, so his laning phase is not actually that bad once you learn how to play with him. And his late game and mid game is insane. Like once you learn how to use your barrels properly, you can like turn around fights by yourself and yeah, just snowball and carry the game. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out the rest of my guides over at lolclass.com.